Young bum buckle up, baby, my J. Yo, my yo, that's what I'm telling you. Know. Say, so, ah, this is the way I'm for the far. We are on so the J. I follow them. I mean, risk him care. Call for a link. Here. Lift up, man. Y'all come talk about Pitney. Move with the officer, dirty boy. Blessed day, my people. So in today's video, we're going to talk about dancehall artist version and a video we see over TikTok, right? And it seemed like version helped to save a baby as some men were seen driving a particular car. And it seemed like the man them drive reckless with the baby in the back scene. But on top of that, based on what I hear in the video, the man they must lick down a girl. One bag of thing I go on, my people. You understand? We can't see version even get emotional in the video. So I played so you can see what I go on. A lot of persons are big up version for what do because anything could that happened to that child anyway my people we're gonna talk about that also we're gonna talk about footer hype saying that vibes cartel gets more love behind bars than when he was actually freed and footer also said that vibes cartel don't have any historical overseas show like busy signal also, we're going to talk about the crab woman, Alice, who plans to file a lawsuit against the woman who video her. Also, we're going to talk about popcorn and tentic gets called out for basically turning dancehall in a watermelon contest. Also, we're going to talk about bounty killer hailing TJ because his drift song went into Billboard. You understand, my people? Also, we're going to talk about dancehall artist Cargo criticizing Vibes Cartel for allegedly beating Black Rhino in the past. And also, we're going to talk about Future Fambo revealing the reason why he has been losing weight and you don't know a video was posted with future fumble basically promoting something i think i promote him i promote something but people them did more a focus on the way how him look you understand my people so what we'll about it anyway my people before we're gonna further into the topics don't forget for like share and subscribe also head over to my instagram page mix up time four but i definitely appreciate that right my people all right so the first thing we're gonna talk about is the video we're telling about with version z in dancehall artist version and based on like the comments them when I say, it seemed like this actually took place down at St. Mary. I'm not sure if I want a place named Highgate or something like that. Not a hundred percent sure. Zine can not come from St. Mary, but I just the comments them. Anyway, so it kinda seemed like some men I drive a particular car with a baby in the back, and it seemed like the man might drive reckless and all of that, right, my people? And it seemed like version must have called some police or something and look like some chase going. Now, I can't show the baby face because at one point, the little baby in the back of the car, I think I two of them. Anyway, a baby did a ball and, you know, I kind of cut out that part there because, you know, YouTube stay and all of that, right, my people? So, I can't show that. But you got to see where the police, them are bad up on the youth, them are not diss him up on a call him B-boy and all them things. The, the police, them also a big up version. Um, as well as even the people in the comment section, because any cat could have played. And based on what they must say, me say I want girl get lit down by the man them. That's how reckless them did a drive. And initially, when I see that video here, me even think it was for a shoot, like a music video, because you know the artists them stay nowadays. But the more I watch it, the more it actually looks serious, even though it could have still be for a music video. But it kind of look a bit serious to my people. Anyway, let me get to this video now so you can see what I go on. And as usual, you can tell me what you're thinking in the comment section. Is it? Remember that you throw the artist here on a pussy wall. You know far where I fall on up? Eh? You know far? I mean, you have to be like that. Boy, whenever you ask me, remember I'm going to tell you. Come out of the car, some pussy. All right, no man. Truth me not learn. Truth me not learn. The baby, stop worrying about the baby, man. You are up, man. I'm going where you go, man. Boy, I'm here. Lift up, man. Y'all come talk about Pitney. Move with the officer, boy. Then what I say, ask for the Pitney again now. But yes, in front of the police, yeah? Better pray to the artist have a good heart for a bum buck like, yeah? Young bum buck like, baby, my J. Yo, my yo, that's what I'm telling you. Know. Say, the artist are doing for the far. We are on so the G I follow them. I mean, risk him care. Call for a link. See it, yeah? Yeah. 
sweet baby there, young. Young, young baby star. No fire with that. Give us some number for you, baby. Um, 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 people, them charge you. Yeah. Make I give thanks to them. I say here. Yeah. Remember that. Yeah. No, I'm going to that one. No, the, I'm not telling you the man do, man. Brother, a chaos. Chaos down there. The man run over one of the girls. Them brawling. I don't know. Up on the car. She goes, she go under the car. Clean. Brother, Mr. Seth, no good. The man push to us as the man push to one rass and rass a car then the next big like a man. semi or something. Right, so the man uh, night the the man tell him, man. The baby, the baby in a car. But me I call the number with them give me and nobody in answer. What them phone? What am I do? I give my dog the phone. Wrap it. Yeah, baby, I'm going to go phone and I'm going to Hey man, you need to pull something and start call some people right now. I come in here, care boy, man. Look, 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 look back from the baby, mad dog. Well, check from the youth for now. Mount of things, you know, though. Yeah, my people, so as I say, it seems very real to me, but you don't know me still. Skeptic when it comes to artists and these type of videos, but only can tell me anything you don't know if this is actually a hundred percent real and everything is authentic. Big up the version, set speed. You understand? Me see some people at about when I police them in a slippers. <laughs> you see it, so you don't know that might make some people wonder if a gimmick thing, but look a bit real to me still. But only can tell me anything about this in the comment section. You see it. Alright, so the next thing we're going to talk about is Futa Hype, who recently was on Instagram Live, see? And Futa did have a debate as it relates to Vibes Cartel and Busy Signal. And also himself, him talk about himself tonight. Now basically Futa say, yo, Vibes Cartel, him don't have any international, like, performances where stand out like a busy signal zine and i guess footer did a compare busy and cartel and who have a bigger impact and all of them thing then you don't know footer rate cartel but it seemed like the respect we have for busy signal they're on a different level you understand my people and you know the gaza fans them now nah, take kind to that footer also said that vibes cartel start get certain love when him end up behind bars and you don't know certain songs start to blow up and all of these things right my people not sure if people are still agree with that you understand what I say, but it is what it is, my people. I'm going to play the video. Only can tell me if you don't agree. Futa say, yo, him travel a whole lot more places than where Cartel even traveled. You understand? And which is obvious. Cartel, they behind bars for how much years, my people. So, you know, Futa see him for do a whole lot of traveling. So, obviously, I'm going to go places where Cartel no go. But as it relates to the impact where Cartel have on dance all worldwide, we're not really sure how much artists have that same impact. They're right, my people, but we could get to this video right about now. You see it, and as usual, only can tell me what you think. And Cartel did a visa when busy now have none. So all Cartel don't have any historic American shows, no historic American things going on. Fever sell gold when Cartel they are jail. And what they may tell I look at you, it's a Cartel get a bigger love and respect when him end up at jail because Jamaicans are patriotic and we love with people them and Buju they get that extra love when him they are jail too. When Buju come out, him show them bigger than before him go in. So if cartel come right now it can be the biggest thing. 
the people they say oh, illiteracy here yeah, man FIFA bigger than watch out for this in America. Is America the world, my friend? Do a world status. Do a world status. Make a reason good. Cartel not got the amount of place where foot and hype go in IRL. Much less one busy. If you calculate cartel movements when him hot, when him dep on the peak of him career, him not gonna know more than so. Him bookings them the limited. No, it's just the truth. Me not try this cartel, you know. But it's the truth. Even when cartel did free, uh, out of a visa, him they have American visa. He was traveling everywhere. He could have got everywhere in our world. He still never create no massive damage in our world. But we're not going to say he's my greatest of all times. If we want to give him the greatest lyricist of all times, then me we work with that. Say so in a dance hall, he's my greatest lyricist. Me we work with that. Zin? So, elephant man. Deal with America like a dog shit. Elephant man. Elephant man. Deal with America like a dog shit. We can have so many great performances by elephant man in America. We can't tell great performance them. Let me ask the Gaza fans them now. Where the, where the, where the, where the, where the, at 97 big show them where him take. Where the, where the reggae tip big show them where him take. Where the rip the run way them where him take. Where the, where the MTV award performance. Where the BET a performance them there. Can't tell them a lot down nowhere like Beanie Man and, and, and Bunty them in America and them something there. Where is it? Europe where? When cartel got Europe, he must be open in the day and perform. Busy signal, close the Europe, show them. Cartel got Europe two or three times. Why the Gaza fans, them not go pull up the video them with cartel performing in Europe? All right, my people. So we're in the thing. Gonna feel like a footer hype hit the nail on the head. Or is he, you know, basically I exaggerate as it relates to busy signal. You see me? Me not like people. Busy signal have some monster hits out there. And even though we see some people are comment and I say like, even the song, when you watch out for this, they must say, you know, a major laser song and this and that. But busy signal vice night, so I'm pretty sure him benefit a lot of that. Anyway, my people, let me know anything about this in the comment section. Is it? So the next thing we're going to talk about is a crab lady named Alice. And also we're going to talk about the woman who actually videoed the whole crab incident. And by now, Holy Power was not supposed to see the video because it went viral. Holy Power people talk about it, it come on news where the woman did a cut her number two. And basically, you know, she had to eat right which part she sell or which part them sell crab because I know she alone it out there. Anyway, my people, you don't know a lot of persons look upon that as nastiness, which me, myself, you know, look upon it as that. And I don't see myself ever would have buy crap from that, from she, you understand? Anyway, so it seemed like based upon the woman who made the video now, she must do an interview, right? And you don't know what day she says she get some only pathetic and them thing there. And on top of that, we are here to the woman, Alice, at her about she got file last suit against the woman. Now, you know me notice in a Jamaica, everybody loves to swing around the world last suit and talk about them I go do that like them can't frighten nobody. The woman never come in your bathroom and video. You understand me and say, you were in a public space doing something. That is the same thing like you're up on the roadside and do it. And basically me video you and put it out there. You can't sue me for that. Now if you're in your bathroom, your personal space, I'm going to open your door and come in there and video you. Then that is a problem. You understand me and say my people. So... The woman named Alice, it kind of seemed like she rang and strong and she don't want to take the wrongs as it relates to what she did. You understand? She not take accountability. She had blamed the woman for video her. Even when the news reporter them did an interview her, she still had blamed the woman. You understand my people? And that are the first mistake we should do. She not take accountability. But on top of that, we see our next video where the woman, Alice, do it again. You understand? I do it already, me should have said. So, obviously, it's not the first time the woman has cut a number two out there. This is something where happen over and over. So, maybe the woman fed up on you and you're nasty, so she video you and put it out there. You understand, my people? But I don't know. But as for the last suit part, 
you can't sue the woman and win. You understand? More people are rock with the woman. Me even say somebody, I say, look, being that them close down the whole crab location and nobody can get for sell, plus the woman I get threats and them thing there, I think they must say I got donate like $100,000 to her. I them a try to raise 100000 I think I donate them, I go donate it to her. Zine and Fefe fe help her, if can start her own a crab shop or whatever it may be. You understand my people, so... I don't know, but you don't know. I have to big up that lady that said speed. You do a good thing. Anyway, let me know anything about this in the comment section. Is it? So the next thing we're going to talk about is popcorn and tentic being called out. Zin, and basically, they might get called out for this whole watermelon thing. Now, of course, since they need forward out and wear popcorn on our shirt with the whole watermelon thing, it has been non-stop back and forth between popcorn and tentic as it relates to this whole melon thing, right? So... A popular TikToker, he might call them out now and I say, yo, them need to go into the studio and stop throwing shades on the internet, right? I'm more if you don't agree with that. Because down to the other day, we see 10 tick put out a next video, um, must with a watermelon and foot or whatever. And we see him, they do it before that, where him smash out the watermelon. So, I don't know, but let me get to this video right now, my people. And as usual, you can tell me what you're thinking in the comment section. You see it? Popcorn. <laughs> Ten tick. Brother. You know a big disgrace to dance all, you know. You know, know that? Popcorn and ten tick. You know a big, big disgrace to dance all. I mean, I'll tell you why I say that. Two big dance hall artists. Right? I want to take dance hall. And I turn it in a watermelon badness. Popcorn. Danny come out and make a thing. And make a picture and thing and thing. With watermelon. You are eat watermelon. Me not see that as nothing. But I you say your name Pepper Skull. Fry yai. So you pre different. It gone one different way. Right? Ten tick. Come profama your, your treat and a little thing go on. Ten tick never take kind to it. You get to me, I say? And, it, and people in the media make ten tick start, start pray away and a little vibes start build up. Fine, a dance all way now. Ten tick go splash out a watermelon in the road. After ten tick, we did we, we don't see popcorn and eat watermelon pan shot. You hear me? All of a sudden now again. Missy Popcorn with a watermelon brawl in Saint the other day with unruly. Carve out in it. Tell me when we go see ten tick do now. Me see ten tick the other day now come pan video. Watermelon on the foot. Popcorn. Watermelon man. Brother, what kind of watermelon bad this one bring in a dance hall? A place as dance hall, brother. You know, a two big artists. It take you know, nothing to go in a studio to record a song. Brother, you know, stop the whole pa shade, shade, chewing, no, brother. As a big artist. Popcorn, a long time, you know, see your face off with a dance hall artist, popcorn. All you do is chew shades. And when you, when you start, you run gone. Nobody know you nothing about you again. All you do from massacre to to when the other one from alkaline to the whole of them. All I see you do popcorn is chew shades and then when the man them ready to start you run gone. Ten tick you know from what year you your career will fall off, brother. Right? Don't get me wrong in there, you're a good artist in ten tick. But from what year your career will fall off, nobody not to you nothing from you. Congrats again, can we see you buy a brand new house ten tick? Big up yourself for that. Yeah, make move. We don't take nothing from the artist, but we are talking the cute. J progress my name. Ten tick from what year we know we know it song. And we know say yeah, it maker. But we know here we know it song. Popcorn I hit maker to it. We not two big bad artists in a dance hall. So we not go with watermelon badness, brother. Look pan TJ the other day. Byron Masaya say one thing about TJ in the media. What TJ do? TJ take it to the studio. And that you call the art of a dancehall artist. The man take it to the studio and go drop at this song. Byron Masaya is not even a Jamaican artist. You get to me, I say, what do you think Byron Masaya do? 
Byron Massey go back to the studio and take it back to the studio. Brother, you know, an artist, you know, an entertainer. A dance hall, you know, represent, brother. Warm to, you know, authentic and popcorn. You know, go in the studio, go build some tune, you know, and entertain the people, them, you know. Missy man, I come with watermelon, you and unruly, Urgh. Then Missy authentic of watermelon on that foot. Popcorn, you know. Brother, you know, go with the watermelon badness, man. I warm to, you know, man. See, I'm not going to dance hall, brother. We're not fooling it. Eh? Right now, even if you start a clash, you don't even like a sting if sting come back up. You don't know do it. Because first thing, popcorn like pick the trouble. But just see when the clashing part come, nobody don't know popcorn there again. Him saying busy at the show. You hear me? I say, Tentic, you know. Your thing not so hot from what here. Brother, you feel like kill popcorn with this track till he answer you. I this say thing. They walk in a watermelon, watermelon thing. What do you just smash out one in our road? No, you have watermelon on that foot. Brother, you don't think a watermelon clash a go on, man. You don't fix up on yourself, man. You don't dance all artists, man. You don't take a page out of, out of TJ book right now. One thing a man say over the media upon TJ. What do you think him do? TJ drop a this track immediately. And you hear TJ in the media brawling at tell Byron must say, yo, rrr. No car no nothing. Him not go around no car and go up on media be, be a post and post, post, post like a media clashing. You see me? Popcorn, tenty. You don't stop water down dance hall, brother. If you don't want the watermelon badness, you don't go up on a big farm with them, with them grow watermelon and go fling watermelon after one another, brother. But you know a dance hall artist and music we want here. Believe. Alright, my people. So, what do you think? You feel like the Tentic and Popcorn need to go into the studio and just make some diss songs against each other. I don't feel like the Popcorn never even need to do that because Popcorn levels, you don't know. People always are draft for the levels card, right? I'm sure the annual fans are going to say no, sir. You know, because some people even feel like the Tentic fall off. Not now go on film. You understand what I say? So, I don't know. People are going to say, oh, Popcorn, nobody resurrect Tentic and all of that car. I don't know the thing, go. Anyway, my people, let me know anything. I don't feel like the artist them should continue throwing shades over Instagram. Leave it in the comment section. So the next thing we're going to talk about is Bounty basically bigging up TJ up top boss. And you don't know so this has to do with TJ Drift Song entering Billboard. And Bounty said that this is huge for dance hall. You see it, my people? So let me get to this article right about now. So it's a bounty killer says TJ Billboard hit drift is huge for the culture. TJ's debut on Billboard's R&B hip hop airplay chart is being supported by the local dancehall community and fans along with bounty killer who earned support for the artist's music. TJ's debut is a career milestone as the song entered the chart at number 47 on Wednesday evening amid his ongoing lyrical beef with fellow artist Byron Messiah. The artist has not officially reacted to the news, but it seems that the Jamaica versus St. Kitts beef started by TJ and Messiah is deepening as Jamaican artists align themselves with TJ. Celebrating the movement of TJ, Noah Warner music label artist Bounty Killer asks fans to buy his music to promote it further. This is huge, not just for TJ, but for the whole culture because not many songs been getting into the billboard since of late. Congrats to TJ at Sharon Burke Solid Agency and Up Top Camp. We celebrate this. Bounty Killer said, he added, do it for the culture, music cheaper than most things, go support the music, put up the flag if you agree. The comment section was proliferated with fans dropping their flags while others congratulated the artist and showed him strength in the typical way Jamaicans support each other. Respect my G, TJ posted in the comments. So yes, my people, it's a good look. Bounty Killer show support to TJ, you understand what I say? So, Bounty Killer says something, music is cheaper than most things. So, you know, it's only right for support the artist and thing. You understand what I say? This is definitely a good look for TJ. No, right now, the entertainer is supposed to feel good, is it? Anyway, my people, let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section. So now we're going to talk about dancehall artist Future Fambo who revealed the reason behind his weight loss, right my people? So let me actually get to this article so I understand what's going on, is it? 
So it's a future Famba shares diabetes behind weight loss, not substance abuse. Dancehall artist Future Famba says his recent weight loss is not a result of DRUG use, but that he has been battling a severe medical condition. The artist addressed fans on Friday as he shared that some have speculated that he was using DRUGS, which caused him to have massive weight loss. However, he assured fans that he was not using any form of DRUGS, but instead dealing with diabetes. Nothing happened to me. I have sugar diabetes for all who care about me. I'm okay, the artist said. He added that his weight loss might be shocking for some, but he was fine. In the meantime, many fans told the artist to focus on his health, while others advised him to leave the alcohol alone as it exacerbates his diabetes. Future Fambo is well known for songs like Roman Red Bull and is also known for promoting tracks that speaks about drinking alcohol. Many felt that he was probably be drinking a lot and needed to stop and take care of himself. The artist also went live to assure fans and his colleagues Sean Paul, Bounty Killer and others that he was fine. So yeah, my people, that is what's going on as it relates to future Fambo. You understand me and some of people. Entertainer does not make you know say I'm all right, regardless of him having, you know, sugar and things. So does not make you know what's going what's going on. So big up yourself, Fambo, and just go and take care of yourself, your brother. You see it? Anyway, my people, let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section. So the next thing we're going to talk about is Cargo criticizing Vibes Cartel for allegedly putting pause on Black Rhino in the past. You see it, my people? So let me get to this article right now, Zin. So the article is saying, Cargo criticized Vibes Cartel for allegedly putting hands on Black Rhino. Dancehall artist Cargo says that Black Rhino was wrong to accept his mentor Cartel putting hands on him and he called out a fan who seemed to celebrate the former Gaza artist's bad treatment. During his usual YouTube par with his fan base called the Cargonians, the Turn Up The Thing artist had much to say after a fan claimed that Rhino deserved to be mistreated by a cartel. The event referenced by the fan was the infamous Gaza Empire situation inflicted on Rhino in 2010, allegedly at the behest of World Boss Vibes Cartel after the artist left, left the Portmore Empire labeled owned and operated by cartel. At the time, he was the third artist to leave under similar and unfortunate circumstances. Black Rhino also reported he suffered some serious consequences after leaving as his Winchester, St. Andrew apartment and Big Yard studio were, you know, caught ablaze after he released a song addressing cartel following the split. None of the allegations have ever been proven and even cartel said he don't condone certain things that went against Black Rhino. Over the years, Black Rhino have been in the background and according to Cargo, he deserves his career to thrive. As he said, people did not call out Vibes Cartel for what he did to the artist. With a pan a rhino campaign dog, when he give out the youth him career. What you mean the man should have take where him get from Cartel? Cargo asks, the biggest thing you could have ever do for yourself is don't take nothing where Cartel do to you. Take what kind of box and kick. Black rhino are the sun, dog. Cartel are doing, are doing own a pitney them. That's why I can't around nobody my youth because the government could have never not give me something to defend myself and me make cartel do certain things to me. That, that's it for you. He continued, Rhino deserve back a run. Cargo urge. It's unclear what the artist has been up to lately, but Cargo says that Javinci and Popcorn, who has a beef with Rhino, should spend $5 million to help cultivate his career. All right, people. So when you think about where Cargo has said, right? You know, feel like, say, Rhino deserve a run because really and truly, my people, I feel like, say, Black Rhino, him, 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 him get blacklisted. I'm not lie. Me feel that way still. You see it? And, you know, maybe some people might say, nah, put out no good songs or whatever. But I feel like even if Rhino put out a bad song right now, it now go get the push like, oh, a popcorn. And though some people are going to say, yo, you can't compare them because popcorn is a bigger artist. And even Javinci right now, they're on a, a, a bigger level than Black Rhino. You understand me and some people, but I don't know. But I just want to leave in the comment section if you don't agree with what Cargo is saying. You understand? And that's it, you know, my people. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Is it. Bless upon yourself until I drop the next video. I'm out.